everyone, it's Kidu, and in this video I'm going to be giving you a closer look at Ash Lynx's right here. Uh, we'll do a little 360. Please ignore my shitty fingernail paint job. It's bad. I really like the way he turned out. His hair's really nice, the paint job is super nice. I ended up posing him um, with his gun out like this, just because I thought it was better to have a little bit of an action-y pose um, until I get AG. When I get AG, I'll be posing him with AG in a probably a cuter, more shippy pose if I can come up with something. So that's what I plan to do then. But this is what he looks like right now. I wasn't sure if I placed his hands properly on the gun, but it, it, it works. Also, there's no uh, movement in his arm pieces with the gun. The, the way it sits is just like it's straight in there and then it has this long piece that kind of pulls out here and then that way you can't move his arms at all like they're just straight out like that you can't angle it any other way sorry this is unfocusing there we go but yeah I think he turned out really cute um my only complaints would be that his hair piece is extremely loose um just touching it like this like slightly pushing forward oh it's not doing it now Oh yeah, there. See, like, I, that was actually no pressure. I don't know if it looked like I put a lot of pressure, but I put, like, nothing. I just, like, touched it, and his hair pops right out. So that's my one complaint, is the hair is really, really loose. Um, but the paint job's really nice, and I like the color. It's very yellow, very ash. Um, and I don't mean ash as in the color of Ash Blonde. I mean ash as in him. But yeah. Also, one more thing I would complain about is that the his little sweater thing here is quite loose. So I'm a little worried about paint transfer with that. The same as being worried about paint transfer for the way his hairpiece on the front wraps around his ears here on both sides. So when that hairpiece comes off, especially with it coming off so easily, I'm a little worried that uh, you're going to get paint transfer from his yellow hair onto his faceplate. That is just a concern of mine. Um, and then a general complaint of the back pegs, which I always have an issue with because I find that they're like it's good that they're tight into the figure but they're so tight and sometimes hard to line up so when you're trying to line them up occasionally uh, it scratches the back of the figure him I was lucky to get it in uh, nicely but sometimes it doesn't happen that way but we'll just give you guys a nice little look at him here I'm excited to pose him sorry I'm excited to pose him with AG in a little more of a peaceful pose. Uh, I just, they deserve to be happy and things make me sad and I just want them to be happy and yeah. Highly recommend the anime or reading the manga. Do not do it if you are faint of heart. It is definitely a heart wrencher. I bald. It, it, it's very sad <laughs> don't go in expecting it to be like I would expect it to be sad because if you go in not expecting it to be sad and then the ending happens and all of your dreams are torn away you know it could be quite shocking um I knew it was gonna end poorly but then Warning if anybody doesn't want spoilers, I'm not really going to spoil it, but I'm just going to talk about how I felt about the ending, slash not what happened, but kind of a general sense of how it went. If, I don't know if that makes sense, but you can skip this if you want. Um, yeah, so just like they give you a puppy and they put it in your hands and then, then they take the puppy out of your hands and then they disembowel the puppy in front of you. That's what the ending felt like, okay? It was... So I thought I was getting one thing, <laughs> but I wasn't. Uh, yeah. Anyways, this is pretty much all there is to show you guys. That's all I really have to complain about. Other than that, I really enjoy the figure. I think he turned out great. I'm excited for AG. I will link his videos in the description below. 
for his unboxing and closer look if you're interested. Also, if you haven't seen his unboxing and you want to see how he's packaged and everything, I'll link that in the description below, along with my affiliate links through CD Japan and Tokyo Talk Mode and all of my social media. So you can check all of that out if you are interested. Feel free. Um, thank you guys so much for supporting me and clicking on the affiliate links and buying stuff through there. I really, really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. And I love interacting with you guys. I'm sorry I've been so non interacty lately. It's just I've been going through a lot of stuff. I'm trying to catch up on things. So I'll eventually be going through comments and trying to reply to all of them soon. <laughs> but yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. If you guys have any questions, ask them in the comments below. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye!